Hey there, welcome to today's video where we're going to dive into a common problem that many macOS users might encounter. So picture this, you're a newbie to macOS, cruising along with your shiny new system boasting a whopping 64 gigabytes of RAM. Everything seems to be running smoothly until you spot some swap usage, even though you have more than six times the available RAM than what's being used. You start to wonder if this is normal or if there's something to worry about, especially when it comes to the lifespan of your integrated SSD. Let's unravel this mystery together. Now, let's talk about the solution to our little conundrum. What you're experiencing is actually quite normal, and a bit of swapping is nothing to lose sleep over. The memory metrics displayed on your system might not be telling the full story. iStat Menus, a handy tool, sometimes masks inactive memory as free memory giving the impression that more memory is available than it actually is. By adjusting the settings to show inactive memory, you'll get a more accurate picture of your memory usage. As for the worry about SSD wear due to swapping, fret not, a few gigabytes of swap won't harm your SSD. The key concern is excessive SSD writes, so as long as you're not approaching one terabyte per day, you're in the clear. In summary, the swap usage you're seeing is nothing out of the ordinary, and a bit of swapping is just part of macOS's memory management strategy. Remember, a little swap won't hurt your SSD, so no need to lose sleep over it. If you want to keep an eye on your SSD's health, tools like DriveDX can help track its usage. So don't sweat the small stuff and keep enjoying your macOS experience. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe for more tech tips, and drop a comment below with your thoughts. Until next time, Happy computing.